KFNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. KFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here. This is the Tiger Financial News Network market update at 10 a.m. Eastern Time on this Monday, the 11th of March. Looking at the Dow down 113 at 38,690, we've been waiting and waiting and waiting for months and then weeks and then days to see what would happen with the nine period exponential moving average. Would it cross negative? And lo and behold, right as we speak, it's finally gone pink. But the day is young. It's a, it's a daily chart. Therefore, you have to wait for the close today. But my suspicion is we're getting real close to seeing the Dow turn pink. It's down 119. The S&P, S&P got repelled uh, from its uh, up-channel resistance, Chapman Wave inside track repellent zone, down 23 at 5,099. Got quite a way to go to more, more or less the 5,060 area uh, before this has go back to our regular charts. All right, here there's the S&P. Let's just do that. There it is. Uh, sitting on the nine period green, nine period moving average, which is way above the 14 period moving average, the trend line, uptrend line, support level right now is at uh, 5,055. We'll see whether we get there over the next uh, week. I, uh, the QQQ and the X100 got repelled sharply, is now underneath the 14 period moving average, made an all time high on Friday. Here we are at four. 435.90 minus 3.15 IWM. Is that going to hold? Well, it's down $1.85 at 2005. So we're watching all of these very closely. Let's go to the gold. Gold is holding fantastically. It's up uh, one and a half points to 2187. It's almost like a single leg A with just a brief peak A. Um, and it's gone above the inside track repellent zone in the weekly chart. So this so far is excellent action there for the dollar. You'd expect it to be pulling back. And lo and behold, it is um, only up seven ticks, but it's pulled back quite sharply at 102.81. Let's go to bonds because that's really important right now. Bonds. Up 8.30 seconds at 121 and 24.30 seconds. Yep. Um, yields are, well, they're okay right now. Crude oil, crude oil is pulling back sharply, down 95 at 77.06. What a market. And as I said on Friday, my suspicion is that we've made some kind of a short term top. We've planned that, we've, we're executing that, and we'll see if that works out. Uh, here's the S&P. We'll look at it when we get back to the Tiger Technicians out. Check out my form of daily newsletter.